Hey everyone, welcome back to Clash Clans TV. Thank you so much for tuning back in. And as you can see, Bacon here, a person in my clan, just did an amazing raid and got over 650,000 resources. And the only reason why is because of full collectors. So you probably already guessed it from the title of this video and the thumbnail. This video is about full collectors. So this is a base, what you call a collector base, where 99% of the resources are in the collectors. And um, what you pretty much want to do, the army you want to bring when attacking these kind of bases is Barch, which is Barbarians and Archers. It's a really fast army to train. It's not the fastest, but it's really fast, it's really cheap, and it's a great way to farm Elixir, Dark Elixir, and Gold to upgrade your troops, to upgrade your defenses, your walls, <clears throat> or anything in your laboratory. So Bacon here just got over 568,000 elixir at this moment and there's two more collectors that are still full on the bottom corner of your screen there. So he's gonna drop the rest of his barbarians to try to get those and 5 seconds left, 3 seconds left, 2 seconds left, 1 second left, 660,000 resources. He got 22 trophies taken away from him but that really didn't matter since it was an amazing raid overall. So of course ladies and gentlemen I have more than one raid to show you. This one is from Star Legend in my clan. So this defender here Ching Chang Chung has over 800,000 resources available and Star Legend here does not have Barch which is pretty odd because that's the best way to farm gold and elixir. But he brought kind of a weird composition. He has dragons, balloons, barbarians and archers. He has his barbarian king, a rage spell and two heal spells. So he goes ahead and just pretty much puts his troops all around the base to try to get as much resources as possible. And there's that Dark Elixir drill on the top there, but Star Legend doesn't end up getting it, which is pretty... I found it pretty disturbing since he had a full Dark Elixir drill. You could have dropped one archer and it would have got all the Dark Elixir, but it really didn't matter. He has over 700,000 resources up until this point, and he has that dragon on the top left corner of your screen there still going at that Elixir storage. So at this point, I would have ended the attack after getting that gold pump on the bottom left corner, but he ends up dropping his balloons and a heal spell, and I think he was he told me he was trying to get the town hall. I personally wouldn't have done so. I would have kept my troops for a future raid, but I guess he decided to go for it. He drops a rage spell and a heal spell to, to get those balloons going and get them all healed up, and he drops his clan castle right behind them. He probably wanted to get the town hall. I'm pretty sure that's what he told me. Um, with those eight barbarians and two archers that he has left, I would have dropped them on that gold pump on the bottom left corner of your screen there, or on the bottom right corner of your screen where that elixir store er, elixir pump is. But he almost got the town hall, but unfortunately, the, unfortunately there was too many defenses that were targeting the wizard going at it. There's 15 seconds left, 46%. I believe he does get the 50% because he still has his barbarian king. I believe he's going to drop it on the bottom right corner of your screen there where that where the uh where the oh I, he didn't even oh yeah he drops it on the gold storage there okay so as you can see that top uh dark elixir drill wasn't even sniped at but it's okay he got over 863,000 resources and 11 trophies so it was kind of a win-win situation great attack on your part star legend let's move on to the third and final attack for this video sync is O oh, in my clan. It's, it is attacking against Robin from Robin de Bois. So it's again a full resource base. 99% of the resources are in the collectors and if you're wondering why Sync is in the bronze one league, uh, he's not usually in that league. It's just I think he was farming below 200 trophies. He's sub 200 farming. I think he was trying it out. But um, I'm sorry, we don't accept bronze one players. So if you want to join, you have to be at least you have to have at least 1,400 trophies. That's a side note. Up until now, he brought uh, the Bam strategy, which is another great strategy for farming gold and elixir. It's composed of barbarians, archers, and dark and um, minions. This base has over 750,000, actually 800,000 resources available. They're all in the collectors, and what he tries to do is use his barbarian king as a tank. So he puts, it, he puts it down first and then his Barbarians and Archers behind them. The Barbarian King is acting like, is taking all the damage from the defenses and then the, and then the Barbarians and Archers behind them are just taking the storages in the middle there and the resources in the pumps. So he, so he uses his King's ability there just because he was losing a lot of health. There's 55 seconds left in the raid and he does end up getting all the resources, well almost all of them indeed. 
Um, he drops his minions right there to go at those gold storages, and he did not have any spells within that. He would have probably got a 3 star, but it didn't really matter since he got a lot of resources and the 2 stars. So we're at 50, 58%. The Barbarians on in the middle and minions and Barbarian King are going at those uh, elixir storages. And now there's 300,000 uh, elixir exactly, and then the Barbarians and minions are just going to go at at the resources and get and get pretty much all of them. So at this point he has over 700,000 resources. There's one more elixir storage with 40 <laughs> zero elixir left. So he has a total of 810, I believe, thousand resources. There's five seconds left into the raid, 81% two star. It was an amazing raid. He missed out on almost 400 dark elixir, but it didn't really matter. It was an amazing raid overall. Good job sync on that attack. And that pretty much wraps up this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. It really helps me out. And um, don't forget the $50 giveaway is coming soon, right when we hit 1,000 subscribers. So thank you so much for watching. And again, have an amazing day.